Hi, Mini Masters. This is the this is the crafts for August fifth. Uh, Mini Masters crafts. So first, what we're gonna do to go along with our story, duck and goose, is we are going to make a goose. So what you need is a paper plate with the one with the ridges, or it can be any kind of paper plate. You need to cut it in half. Need some um, plain piece of white paper and I, like a scrap paper, and I actually cut it into, it looks kind of like a peanut, a shape kind of like that. That's gonna be the head and that's the body. And then you need some um, scrap pieces of orange paper, some scissors, of course, and then I have some white tissue paper. You can also use feathers if you have feathers on hand. You need a glue stick and some sticker eyes. So to make your fun little, little bird here. This is gonna be the wings. So we take his body and we wanna glue him to the body just like that, to the wings. So you wanna glue him all the way down to the edge here. Just like so. And then these are his wings. So let's give him some eyeballs. Ta-da. Okay, so now he needs a beak and some feet. So I'm gonna fold this in half and I'm going to give get a couple of feet. So it's kind of just like a, a long line with, two, with a triangle at the bottom. That's kind of how I make my feet. Cut it in half, see, just like that. And I'm going to glue it like that. And I'm gonna tuck it under his body just right here. So they stick out like that. There you go, there's his little feet. Then you need another triangle for his beak. Here we go. This one is a very large, very large beak, but that's okay. Whoa, look how big that beak is. And then to finish up your little guy, you take your tissue papers and cut them or rip them into little squares. And we just decorate his wings with the tissue paper. Kind of gives it a little bit of dimension. Again, if you don't have tissue paper, if you have some feathers you wanna add, you can do that as well. You can even use um, like Kleenex too, if you don't have wrap like paper like this. There you go. Just makes a cute little goose. And if you don't have sticker eyes, you can always just draw his eyes as well. Okay, that's it for our little goose, our little paper plate goose. Isn't he cute? So the other thing that I wanted to show you guys was a fun little activity. It's very, it takes very little time, but we're actually gonna decorate um, a seashell. So what I did was I went ahead and painted my seashell, but what you can do is you can color on it with crayons, color on it with markers, anything that you wanna do. It can be any kind of seashell. The flat ones, the rough ones. We're gonna make little seashell friends. So once I've done that, I just wanted to make it one color. And then I'm gonna take some googly eyes and I'm gonna put some eyes on them and make them into a little seashell friend. So if you don't have any googly eyes, you can always make some eyes. So there's one. And I'm using glue dots, which are really easy to glue things like googly eyes. So there you have it. It's a pretty simple activities for duck and goose go to the beach. These are fun little, these are almost like pet rocks, but they're, but they're pet seashells. Any kind of seashell you want and decorate it however you want. So thanks for coming to my quick tutorial on how to do a pet seashell and a fun little paper plate seagull or a goose actually. It could be a goose or a seagull, either way. Um, thank you guys, bye.